My name is Denny, I'm a physiotherapist, and today we're going to do some exercises to relieve neck pain. Remember, no exercise should be painful. If it's the case, please see a physiotherapist. Now, let's do the exercises together, step by step. So the first movement is very simple. You're going to turn your head to your right and then to your left. And you're going to do this for about 60 seconds. Be sure to breathe normally and to keep your head, your shoulders and your hips well aligned. You should have a good posture while doing this, but try really to keep your muscles relaxed. We don't want to have a straight and a stiff posture just adopt a posture which you're comfortable with. When you're turning your head, be sure that your shoulders are not moving because if they are turning, maybe you're not doing the exercise with your neck, but with your shoulders, and that's not what we want. and we're going to take a short break for a few seconds. The next movement is a movement of lateral flexion. It's pretty easy, you have to bend your neck so your ear will go very close from your shoulder. You do this on both sides. And when you do the exercise, be sure not to turn your head. To help you, maybe you could do this exercise once in front of the mirror just to be sure you're doing it properly. And again, when you're doing this exercise, you have to breathe normally and keep your shoulders relaxed. I suggest that you do this movement pretty slowly at first, but when you'll get used to it, you could do the movements a little bit faster. And we're going to take a short break for a few seconds. This movement is a little tricky, but it's very, very useful. You have to turn your head first at about 50% of your normal range. And after that, you add a lateral flexion. This is not so easy to do, so take your time. Give you some time also to get familiar with the exercise. Don't ask yourself to do it like 100%. Just try to learn it, and with time you'll do it the, the right way. And like the previous exercises, try not to move your shoulders when you do the exercise. And let's take a short break for a few seconds. This next movement is also a tricky one, but you go, you're going to have to start with a lateral flexion at about 50% of your normal range, and you're going to add the rotation. So it looks like if we're doing the same thing, but we're not because we're starting with lateral flexion. The previous movement, we started with the rotation. Same advice, try not to move your shoulders while you're doing this movement and breathe normally. Doing this exercise in front of the mirror could help you also to understand the movement, which is not so easy.
and we're going to take a short break for a few seconds. This exercise is one of my favorite. You're going to turn your shoulders to, to your right and then to your left without moving your head. You're going to take your time to do it. You could do it also in front of the mirror the first times. And it's not so easy to do when our neck is sore or when our neck is stiff. And we're going to do it for about 60 seconds. And let's take a break for a few seconds. The next movement is a small one. You will have to adapt it to your physical condition. And you can use your hand to support your shoulders. It's probably going to be easier to do the movement. And don't forget to breathe normally. And let's take a break for a few seconds. Now it's time for a self massage and we're going to do it for about 90 seconds. Some of my patients prefer to do this self-massage while they're lying on their back instead of doing this massage while they're sitting. And after a self-massage, you could put some heat on your neck just to help your muscles to relax a little bit more. I really hope you feel better. If you like my video, please give it a thumbs up, write me a comment, share it on your social media and ask me your question. I will answer them in new videos. So take care of yourself and see you soon.